Okay, because this is better than anything. I like this kind of stuff. Okay, Wahoo. Wahoo. Wahoo is in the mackerel family. Okay. okay. It's like uh, kingfish and Spanish mackerel and Ciro mackerel are also in the same family. But those are uh, a fishier, greasier tasting fish. You said Wah something about kingfish too. Wah kingfish are in the mackerel family. Wahoo are the are the cream of the crop. They they uh, they can swim 70 miles an hour. They taste good, or do you, oh, you don't fish? No, you don't, you don't eat them. Very good. Oh, oh no, you eat them. Okay. They uh, they come up from deep and they cut their baits in half, their food in half, and they come back and get the pieces. Sort of so like a if shark. you're going out, if you're going out uh, dolphin or mahi fishing, then you. Uh, you, if you run a downrigger or a deep drop lure down deeper and run around the outside of the dolphin mahi, then you're gonna hook up with some wahoo. And wahoo, the, the wahoo is a that's a Hawaiian. They, I, I believe Hawaiian. They call them wahoo, and they're just they're they're sleek. They're they're blue stripes, little tiny teeth, only a quarter of an inch, but they overlap like uh, like uh, scissors, and they'll cut through shit. They're just, uh, but they they can jump, uh, they can sky. Uh, there's been reports of Wahoo in the Pacific uh, with a buddy that uh, I know that he makes uh, fly fishing reels. And he takes a, a boat out to the Magdalene Islands. But this is the land, Atlantic know, Ocean. They're, they're over there. They're, they're over, over there. The Pacific they're too. over here. Okay. And right. they will. They'll sky over the boat. King, kingfish and wahoo will jump sometimes when they're coming up from the deep. They'll come up from 150 feet down to cut a bait in half, and they'll. They may jump out of the water. 15 feet. Man. And but and Wahoo, well, when they hit a bait, they may, uh, I, I mean, if you're running 30 pound or 40 pound test, and they may take, uh, they may in uh, 10 seconds take, uh, you know, 200 yards of line out. And they, they don't cut your line. I mean, well, they, as they, long they, as you're running a steel leader, you need a, you need a, like a piano wire. So basically uh, they have real sharp teeth. Real, well, their teeth are tiny, but they cut through the shit. And so even braided, even the twisted stranded wire. If you're fishing for Wahoo, you want to run a single strand cigar, uh, steel leader. And so in the Florida Keys... You can still catch them on mono, but they, Wahoo have, tend to... And it, when they're caught, they try to work up the line, and they'll they'll eventually get past the hook and get to the mono. So they're smart fish. No, they're just a, they're just a fish. I don't know that all fish. I don't know that fish are smart. I don't know. I don't know. I know that fish. fish are really smart. I know that no. I think fish are when you when you're trying to catch fish. You try to trigger their innate feeding instinct. Okay, they when you set up a uh, the, the the behind the boat when you got a spread of lures out, you're trying to mimic uh, bait fish, and you're trying to <laughs> you're trying to. <laughs> I'm the best girlfriend. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Anyway, wahoo is the best eating fish you oh, can ever get.